Yesterday, we discussed the baptism of the first Baptist by John Smith. However, only months after baptizing himself, Thomas Helwes, and around 40 followers, Smith renounced his self-baptism, and thus the baptism of all of those he had baptized. As Leon Macbeth tells us in the Baptist Heritage, Smith concluded that his self-baptism was born of a hasty and unwise impulse, and that true baptism must be performed only by someone who had already been baptized as a believer. So he asked the members of that fledgling Baptist church in Amsterdam to repudiate their baptism as well, and to join him in seeking membership in a Mennonite congregation. Many did, but not all. As Macbeth tells us, Thomas Helwes and several others insisted that though Baptists and Mennonites both practiced believers' baptism, there were fundamental differences between the teachings of the two groups that the Baptists could not afford to ignore. Joining the Mennonites would compromise their principles and destroy their Baptist identity. Besides that, they were quite satisfied with the baptism they had received from John Smith. So Helwes and his Baptist remnant took the painful step of asking John Smith and his followers, numbering over 20, to leave their church. By now, Helwes' trust in Smith had been exhausted by Smith's ever-shifting convictions. It, this was likely the reason for Helwes urging the Mennonites to think twice before accepting Smith as a member. And the Mennonites never did accept Smith's membership application. In the summer of 1612, John Smith fell seriously ill. On August 20th, the man who only three years earlier in Amsterdam had been instrumental in founding the First Baptist Church died without membership in any organized church. Two and a half years after Smith's death, the Mennonites accepted his followers as members. John Smith and his followers thus disappeared from history as a separate identifiable group. In tomorrow's Baptist Brief, we'll look at how Thomas Helwes and his group kept the Baptist flame burning. Thank you.